Hello and welcome back to my channel. If you saw last week's video, you'll know why that I've been able to set up this snazzy shot here. Take a look at that. But when I finished last week's video, I realized I forgot probably the most important tip there is when it comes to delivering a message on camera and being involved in a corporate video. And it is this, how to answer a question. If you want to know how to answer a question the next time you are asked to take part in an interview, please continue watching this video. As always, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Let me know in the comments below if there are any topics that you would like me to cover in further videos. So the first tip when you are being asked questions is Remember, you are not going to hear the voice of the person asking the question. So let's take an example question like, what did you have for breakfast? A bad answer to that question would be toast. A good answer would be, for breakfast this morning, I had toast. So what you need to remember when you're part of an interview is you're not going to hear the interviewer's voice. My second tip relates to my first tip, but it's about how to start your answer. It can be very difficult when you're put on the spot and somebody asks you a question on camera to know how to start with a strong response. So let's talk about the breakfast question because it's easy. If somebody said, what do you think about breakfast? You can take that question and create a strong answer by saying, I think breakfast is really important. In fact, it's the most important meal of the day. So you see what I've done there. I've basically just taken the question to create my answer. My third tip when it comes to answering questions on camera is short is good, really long is bad. Now, I already covered in tip number one that by short, I don't mean a word, one word answer. You need to give some context in your answer because you're not going to hear the interviewer's voice, but really long rambling answers that are now not even answering the question. They're telling, that are now not even answering the question. They're going into all sorts of detail that doesn't matter are bad. So short and concise is good long rambling bad. My fourth tip when it comes to answering questions on camera is this, and I'll show you an example as I'm talking about it. You need to know who you are directing the answer to. So are you directing it to somebody who's interviewing you where you're looking slightly off camera, or are you looking down the camera lens? And if you're looking down the camera lens, then you need to make sure that you look down the camera lens and you don't just refer to it every now and then. Because as you can see, it's really irritating for the person who's watching. So know where you need to look. If you need to look off camera, then look straight at the person who's interviewing you. Look them directly in the eye. And if you need to look down the camera lens, and make sure you do that. My fifth tip, and perhaps the bugbearer of mine is this. When you have answered your question and you've delivered that perfect response, hold your eye line for just a couple of seconds. Because the worst thing you can do is answer the question and as soon as you've answered it, do this. Look down, even worse, do this. <gasps> Oh, thank God that's over. Because if we don't get a strong end, we can't use the clip and you're just going to have to answer it again. So make sure you finish strong. Look straight at the camera. If you're looking into the camera lens, hold that for a couple of seconds and then relax. So those are my five top tips for how to answer a question on camera. Please do give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Let me know in the comments below what videos you'd like me to create next. Thank you so much for watching and I look forward to seeing you next week. Thanks for watching that video. I hope you found it useful. If you did, here's a link to some more. Please do subscribe because I'll be uploading videos weekly.